Hello, my dear students. Good evening. I hope you are well and safe. I try to stay at home. Don't mix with other people so that you can stay healthy, happy, and comfortable. Uh, I advise you to read as much written material as you can. Of course, you fi can find uh, many things uh, written material of online and offline you can read stories you can read the news you can read uh, on many subjects uh, I mean the, you are interested in uh, today we have a uh, reading one course lesson 9 uh, part 2 let's begin When a death occurs, the family has religious, social, and legal responsibilities. If the deceased has left an explicit set of papers in an accessible file, arrangements for will be much easier for the family to make. For example, such papers should include the deed for a burial, blot, if there is one, a statement as to whether cremation or burial is desired, a copy of the birthplace, and the names and addresses of all family members and friends who should be notified. Furthermore, the bearer should include information on bank accounts, safe deposit boxes, and insurance policies as well as the will. The person in charge of the funeral will need to know how much money is available in order to determine the expenses he or she may reasonably incur for the family. If, the, if, re, if feasible, the person to, who makes the funeral arrangements should be or should not be one of the bereaved. A melancholy widow may not be able to make objective decisions regarding expenses such as for a coffin. Whoever makes the funeral arrangements uh, realizes that he or she is deputized to make legally binding contracts with funeral uh, director and others, which will probably be honored some months later when funds from the estate are released. One of the duties of the person in charge of the funeral is uh, to prepare a death notice for the newspapers. Often the mortician arranges for the insertion of the notice included in the information should be the date of death the names of the family members and the time and place of a forthcoming interment that's the end of uh, the passage so you should read it at, at least twice to understand the meaning now we turn to the questions we have general cooperation answer the following questions about main idea and supporting details number one the main idea of paragraph number one is that a funerals are melancholy occasions b everybody should leave a will so that Survivors will know how much property they will inherit. C. Everybody should put important papers uh, together for uh, his, uh, his or her survival, survivors. D. All friends and relatives of the deceased should be advised of the funeral arrangements. The answer is uh, C. Everybody 
should put important papers together for or his or her survivors. Question number two. The supporting details of paragraph one give instruction about making federal arrangements. C. Specify the types of papers required to make federal arrangements simpler. Uh, C. Explain why a birth certificate is an important requisite for a death certificate. D. None of the above. The answer is, of course, uh, regarding uh, the arrangements, should be B. Specify the types of papers required to make funeral arrangements simpler. The main idea of paragraph 2 is in the first sentence, uh, B. Implied, C. In the last sentence, D. Not clearly stated. I leave it for you to answer. The supporting details in the, in the paragraph number 2. T uh, a. Tell why a widow spent too much on funeral arrangements. B. Explain the duties of a funeral director. C. Emphasize the unpleasant nature of funeral arrangements. D. Explain why a disinterested person should make funeral arrangements. The answer is D. What is the main idea of paragraph 3? Is it stated or implied? I leave it for you to answer. Number 6. List the supporting details of paragraph 3. You can refer to the passage to uh, I mean, answer this question. And now we turn to the second uh, type of exercises. We have here vocabulary work. Choose the correct synonym of the following underlined words. So we have number one, the deceased left you all her diamonds. Deceased means A, missing person, B, dead person, C, wealthy person, D, relative. Deceased means, uh, of course, uh, dead person that is B uh, she left explicit instructions regarding her burial explicit means A vague B exciting C uh, irregular D clear it means uh, D clear number three because the information was uh, easily accessible, we found it immediately. Uh, accessible means A, acceptable, B, accessory, C, reachable, D, uh, probable. The answer is C, reachable. Number four, property deeds belong in a safe deposit box. Deeds means A. Actions B. Legal papers C. Wells D. Addresses Deeds means B. Legal papers Number 5. He was careful not to uh, incur too many uh, bills for the widow to pay. Incur means A inquire b pay c acquire d change anchor means c uh, acquire number six a funeral is a melancholy event melancholy means a meaningful b medical c expensive d sorrowful the answer is D. Sorrowful. The family deputized a close friend to make the funeral arrangements. Deputized means A. Disputed. B. Deprived. C. 
delegated, D dispatched. The answer is C delegated. Number eight, the funeral director gave the death notice to the lo local newspaper. And death notice means obituary, uh, A or B funeral, C burial, D biography. The answer is A obituary. Number nine, the undertaker waited three months after the funeral for his bills to be paid. Undertaker means A, a tax collector, B, beginner, uh, C, mortician, uh, D, priest. The answer is C, mortician. Number 10. In a tropical countries, the interment takes place within 24 hours of a death. Interment means A, intermittent, uh, B, burial, C, mourning period, D, uh, inter interruption. The answer is B, burial. Now we turn to the second uh, passage we have here the central park conservancy raised 39 thousand dollars in private donations to employ 25 high school students for, from the new york area with commendable zeal the participants are embellishing the park as well as weeding the and cleaning uh, unkempt areas Although their employ, employment is merely in interim work over the summer, the youths share the affinity for horticulture. Collaboration with the conservancy only whets their appetites for further endeavors with nature and ecology. Right, I advise you to read it at least uh, once. Now we have, uh, I mean, these exercises. Uh, vocal work, getting the meaning from context. It shows the alternative, that means the synonym, that best completes uh, the uh, sentence. Yeah, which one? The best alternative, the best choice. Number one, John and Mary, blank space, on all their books, she writes uh, the text and he uh, does the artwork. A, study. B, collaborate. C, uh, discuss. D, divide. The answer is B, collaborate. It is, uh, uh, I mean, his efforts uh, to keep uh, the beast were so space that he was awarded the Nobel Peace Prize. We have A. Lucrative, B. Uh, mercenary, C. Uh, commendable, D. Heavy. The answer is commendable. Number three, they worked from dawn to dusk with such space that they were exhausted. A, boredom. B, detraction. C, debility. And D, zeal. The answer is D, zeal. Number four, before they sold their house, they spent two months space it. We have uh, trying, uh, trying it, uh, finishing it. B, C, sifting, and D, planting. The answer is B.
Uh, number five, the space in the program uh, were high school students. Number A, uh, donations. B, endeavors. C, gardens. D, participants. And the answer is uh, D, participants. Number six, in the space between shows, the actors went to Paris. Here, A, rush, B, closing, C, interim, and D, practice. The answer is C, interim, means between. He felt such a close space for animals that he became a veterinarian. Uh, of course, here we have uh, A, distaste, B, affinity, C, approach, D, likeness. The answer is B, affinity. Number eight, a bite of a chocolate cake only space my desire for more. Here, A, spares. B. Let's C. Changes and D. Wets. The answer is Wets. Number nine. Working in the park stimulates his interest in space. N. A. Archaeology. B. Horticulture. C. C. Zoology. Zoology. D. Biology, and the answer is horticulture. B. Uh, number ten. We'll have to clean up this space yard before the guests arrive. Uh, A. Here tired. B. Unlikely. C. Undone. D. Unkempt. The answer is, of course. Unkempt. Now, uh, this is the end of the session. Uh, once again, I advise you to read as much written material uh, in English, both online and offline. You can choose to read simple, short uh, texts so that you can improve your reading skill as well as uh, improving your uh, vocabulary and uh, my routine uh, advice to you is that if you have any questions please let me know I try to study hard and uh, revise in time uh, prepare revise in time my success or my advice for you to succeed is that success plan uh, depends on three things preparation attendance and revision you can prepare the lesson and you can of course uh, attend the lectures finally you can revise the, uh, the lecture or lessons uh, thank you for the moment and goodbye.